Today on MTG Unpacked, we're getting stuck into a bunch of March of the Machine set boosters for patrons. Today's patrons we have Teddy W, Matteo Vanti, Miles Thornton, Sherman, and let's get cracking here. So we're grabbing four packs a piece, and we will see if we can get some spicy goodness today. Thank you for being a patron, Teddy. Any patrons get the rares, mythic spoils, and anything over a buck, along with the art cards, and anything from the list. And we do all of that to save the patrons on shipping costs. Alright, we start off here with Seraph of New Capenna. Flipping around into Seraph of New Phyrexia. We've got a Botanical Brawler, Scrappy Bruiser, Stormclaw Rager, Nazumi Informant, War Historian, a forest and hit hit it sugu and carry got a bit of a peek at a list pool there so what is it it is imps taunt nice what is that uh, tempest i think is the set symbol followed by a foil mythic kruxa and kunaros yes and fairy mastermind another nice pull what? Thalia and the Get Rog Monster Mythic. Okay, another sleeve worthy pull. Eric Smithy's Slumbering Isle. And we will also chuck in the Invasion of Ergamon with Truga Cliff Charger on the other side. That was an absolutely insane pack. So we got tons of rares and mythics. Very nice pulls indeed for Teddy W. Let's hope that continues on to the second pack. So what have people uh, pulled out of this set so far? Any uh, of the Phyrexians? What is your favorite card? Let me know in the comments. Okay, so we have Invasion of Eldrain. On the other side, we've got Prickle Fairies. Interesting. Aetherblade Agent flipping it around. Into Gataxian Mind Stinger, Oracle of Tragedy, Furnace Rain, Stasis Field, Afara's Dispersal, Temporal Cleansing, Dismal Backwater, and Art Card is Atali Primal Conqueror. Yes, there he is, <laughs> except he's being completed, so that's a little bit sad. And Skirt Fire Marshal from the list, nice. Goblin Lord, yes, and another Mythic. Zergo and Ojitai, followed by a Bloated Processor and a Moti Celebrant of Bounty. Let's check in the Legendaries and Elspeth's Talent. That's another rare. Okay. Doing really well. Did we miss any Legendaries? Nope. So grabbing the sleeves for yet another Mythic. So this one's an Orc Dragon. Very nice. Okay. So halfway through for Teddy W. The madness just continues here. And what is up with these packs? Maybe, oh, you know what? I should be using a pull tab. These are Japanese printed. Okay, then. I've been struggling all this time. I got Completed Huntmaster, Gift of Completion, Trailblazing Historian, Sunder the Gateway, Converter Beast, Marauding Dreadship, Rugged Highlands, and Art Card is Atraxa, Praetor's Voice. Yes, we pulled one of those the other day. Very tasty indeed. And we've got a soldier token. Foil arachnoid adaptation. And chrome host seed shark. Yes, Phyrexian sharks are a thing. Jury master of the review. And invasion of Muraganda. Looks like some dinosaurs on that plane. I wonder if it's part of Ixalan. We've got primordial plasm. And Sun Blessed Guardian with a Furnace Blessed Conqueror on the other side. One more pack here for Teddy. Can we continue that mythic streak or has it died out? And we'll just pull hot garbage for the rest of the video. We've got Order of the Mirror on the other side. We've got Order of the Alabaster Host, Shivan Branch Burner, Wicked Slumber. Belated Battle Fan, Attentive Sky Warden, Threshing Frontliner, Alabaster Host Sanctifier, and an Island Art Card. We have Invasion of Cadhaim. That was a good set. 
I really like the angel decks around that time. And we got an incubator with a Phyrexian. Nothing too exciting there. Foil Expedition Lookout. And Yagel and Moltani. Welcome. Followed by Inga Runeyes. And the Invasion of Belanon. With Belanon War Anthem and some Loxodon goodness going on there. Okay, so the best pull, that's going to be a tough one. I'm going to say, where is it? Thalia and the Gitrog monster is pretty cool. That is an epic team up indeed. Okay, next patron, we have Matteo Venti. Thank you for being a patron. Four packs coming right up. Okay, that's much easier to use the pull tabs. Flip around here. We have Invasion of Algrotha. And on the other side, Grandmother Ravi Sengir. Sun Blessed Guardian. And on the other side, we've got a Furnace Blessed Conqueror. Mutagen Connoisseur. Streetwise Negotiator. Red Cap Hill Slasher. Goblin Rogue. About time we saw some goblins. Expedition Lookout. Zalfran Shapecraft. Blossoming Sands. And Art Card. Quintorius Lawmaster, and we do get the signed version, not too shabby. He is now a Planeswalker, in case you missed the news. Uh, just an ad card. Foil Elvish Vatkeeper, and Heliod, the Radiant Dawn. Yes, we got a god pull, but what happened to him? He turned into Heliod, the Warped Eclipse, a Phyrexian god. Fia, Judge of Valor. And Invasion of Dominaria. Was Dominaria your favorite, favorite plane? Leave a note in the comments. We've got Sarah Faithkeeper on the other side. Three more packs, Mateo. I don't know. I think we're in the hot garbage phase. Oh, looks like a signed art card, though. Okay, we've got Dina Soul Steeper from uh, Strixhaven, I believe. Teferi's Talent. Okay, there's a rare... Invasion of Armenkert. Oh no, Armenkert, really? They've had enough uh, between that and Nicole Bolas. We've got Lazotep Convert on the other side. Skyclave Aerialist. Flipping around into Skyclave Invader. Collective Nightmare. Stoke the Flames. Hangar Scranger. Golden Scale Aeronaut. And a Forest. We'll check that in as well. Invasion of Eldraine, and we do get a signed art card. It doesn't like to focus on those for some reason. And learn to play magic. There's like a QR code there. And an elemental. And foil jury, master of the review. Nice. And invasion of a Coria. Ding, 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 ding. That is a sleeve worthy pull indeed. Zalotha Apex of Ikoria, awesome dinosaur on the other side. Let's sleeve it up. Quend Pride of Femareth to finish. Okay, I was beginning to wonder, but we did get something tasty. I liked Ikoria as well. The uh, mutate mechanic in that one was fun. Two more packs. Oh, magic minigame time. Mateo is on the edge of his seat. Can't believe his luck. We got Piratic Prankster. And on the other side, Glistening Goremonger. Furnace Gremlin. Phyrexian Sensor. Traxxas Fall. Vanquish the Weak. Icor Drinker. Planes. And we have Realm Breaker, the Invasion Tree for the art card. That's some pretty cool artwork. And. A magic mini game, strictly better, and you've probably got about ten copies of this, but it's all good because it is a magic mini game. Everybody loves those. Foil Blight Reaper Thalad, flipping it around into Blight Sower Thalad, a Phyrexian fungus. Oh, that's colourful. Kogla and Yadaro, nice comic book art. Uh, ape dinosaur turtle. We've got Ray of Master Smith, Ayara First of Lockthwain, I like that artwork as well. And Invasion of Zendikar, these Phyrexians are going everywhere, aren't they? Awakened Skyclave on the other side. Okay, one more pack here for Mateo. 
So not only did we get him an invasion of Ikoria, but he got a magic mini game. You can't ask for too much better than that, to be honest. Well, you can, but you're probably not going to get it. We've got Kenra Spell Spear on the other side. We have Gataxian Spell Stalker, a Phyrexian Jackal, apparently. Astral Wingspan, Ramosian Greatsword, Joyful Storm Sculptor, Aerial Boost, Mirren Bane Splitter, Castle Stepped Guard, Thornwood Falls, and Art Card is cut short. So we've got the Emperor here. I think that's supposed to be Tamio in the background. Bit of lore going on there, I think. And we have an elemental token. Invasion of Mercadia in foil, no less. And we flip it around into Chiron Flamerite, a goblin spell shaper. Love it. And tribute to the World Tree, followed by Valdak, Keeper of the Flame. And Invasion of New Capanna with a Holy Frazzle Cannon on the other side. What do people think of uh, New Capanna? I know it's considered one of the weaker sets, but there are a bunch of people out there who like it. I think it's a very different theme. So here we have Ikoria. Enjoy the pools, Mateo. Four packs coming right up for Miles Thornton Sherman. Thank you for being a patron. These cards want to fly around everywhere. All right, four packs. Let's go. Can we get some tasty mythics in at the close? So we've got Invasion of Eldraine in Focus Saints. Yep, we saw that one earlier. And Piratic Prankster, I think we saw him as well. Phyrexian Awakening, Corruption of Tawashi. Coming in hot, Infected Defector. Traumatic Revelation, a Swamp. And art card is Invasion of Kamigawa. Nice. Okay. And what else? We got an Incubator with a Phyrexian. Nothing too exciting there. A Foil War Trained Slasher Wolverine Dinosaur. Oh, and a rare Invasion of Segovia. What are those like eel looking things? Looks like an underwater type deal. We've got Cetus Sea Tyrant of Segovia, that makes sense then. And Renata called to the hunt for the legendary, followed by a Yargle Glutton of Urborg. So that's uh, Yargle's second appearance in this video. And they actually did a whole secret lair about uh, Yargle. Link in the corner, I think it was called like Yargle Day. Very strange indeed, but yeah, you can check that out. At the Link in the corner, we have Invasion of Regatha, and on the other side, Disciples of the Inferno, followed by Captive Weird, flipping it around into Completed Conjurer, Scornblade Berserker, Fearless Scald, Mirror Shield Hoplite, Etched Host, Doombringer, Mirrodin Avenged, Negate, and a Plains art card, we have Errant and Giada. Okay, goes around that way, does it? Something like that. That's pretty cool. And a troll card, because that's what it is. Foil Trailblazing Historian. And Drainer and Linvala. Another nice team up. Followed by Judith, the Scourge Diva. Okay. Last two packs here. I don't know. I don't think this video will end up in the Greatest Hits playlist. The Greatest Hits in Channel History. Link in the corner in case you've never seen that. But we will keep our fingers crossed nevertheless. We've got the Invasion of Kaladesh. There's another disappointing invasion. We have Aetherwing, Golden Scale Flagship. Followed by Takir, Dune Shaper. Yes, they went to Takir as well. Burnished Dune Stomper. Merciless Repurposing, Lithomantic Barrage, Realm Breakers, Grasp, Timberland Ancient, Knight of the New Coalition, Windscarred Crag, Art Card is Collective Nightmare. And we do have a list pool in this one. What is it? It is Urtai's Meddling. All right. And Foil Placid Rotten Tail, a Fungus Rabbit. And a Mythic. Yes, Sword of Once and Future. That is what we're looking for. Zertai, the Dawn Waker, Phyrexian, Pegasus. And that is it. So, yep, grabbing the sleeves again. I was beginning to wonder, maybe the luck had run out. 
pop that in a sleeve for you. Final pack magic here. March of the Machine. And what is going on? I can't get into this pack. Let's just tear it apart. Holy moly, that's embarrassing. All right, Miles. It better be a good one after all of that. We have Nazumi Freewheeler, a Rat Samurai. On the other side, we got a Hideous Flesh Wheeler. Mutagen Connoisseur, Streetwise Negotiator, Protocol Knight, Scroll Shift, Searing Barb, Final Flourish, a Mountain. Let's chuck that in. Art card is Bloodfell Caves. Another list, Paul. What's going on here? We're way above the usual amount, I think. We've got a Blazing Shoal. What is that? Kamigawa block. And a Foil Invasion, Invasion of Kylem. And on the other side, we got Valor's Reach Tag Team and Polukranos Reborn. You'll never guess it's a Phyraxian Hydra. We got Polukranos Engine of Ruin for the rare, followed by Zeta Hedron Grinder, a Goblin, and Invasion of Moag with a Bloom Wielder Dryads on the other side. So some pretty tasty pulls today, I must admit. Uh, the highlight here for Miles, we have Sword of Once and Future. Enjoy the pools. Hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day.